Oke. Okay. Eh. Hola, chico. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night. Chico, quiero hacer un, un testing ahorita, una prueba de sonido. A ver si ustedes por mera casualidad escuchan por qué. Ok, vamos a... Ok, guys. Eh, welcome, one more time, guys. Welcome, everybody. Eh, well, as I was talking to you at the beginning of the class, I was mentioned to you about something related to the meter eh, that is according with the section three, right? Now, what are we going to do? We're going to do like a feedback or a review uh, about the meter of the section three. Uh, how this will help us? This will help us to understand a little bit deeper uh, which were our mistakes, uh, why this one gets good, this one gets wrong, and how the, this structure is applied, how this structure works, how we can change, I don't know, some pronouns, some some possessive, all those kinds of things. And that really will, will help you because I think we have 21, right? The one that were not connected uh, before we start recording the class. Uh, I don't know if you already have done the the meter of the section three. Los demás que nos habían conectado antes de, 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 de que comenzáramos la grabación. Marisol lo, lo, lo hizo. Marisol de Los Ángeles. Hello, teacher. Sí, ya lo terminé. Ok, Elsa, did you did the, the meter? Sí, yes. Ok, Daniela, did you did the meter? Did you do the meter, sorry? No, teacher. Ok, but you, you can do it tonight. Eh, Ingrid Esmeralda, did you do the meter? Yes, teacher. Okay. Uh, Karina Yamilet, I don't know if you already did the, the meter. Aníbal, Maria Wendy, Carla Gabriela Garcia, Anderson Jeremy, uh, Karina Beatriz. Pero vamos a, vamos a. Teacher, aparejo que no lo he, buenas noches, aparejo que no lo he hecho. No, es que no, no he revisado hoy, hoy por hoy. Yo la, este, la este semana día. pasada, lo, yo la semana pasada terminé eso. Qué ah, de seguro fue que, que el viernes de la semana pasada que yo le comentaba que me voy a la ciudad, uh -huh. ahí aprovecho el internet de allá y el viernes lo trabajo todo eso. Uh -huh. Ok, no, no, no. Uh -huh. oh, okay. no, 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 no hay problema. Este, como la cuestión a veces es que se actualice y cuando lo vimos ayer, o no sé si yo lo pasé por alto y no, no, no me fijé bien. Uh -huh. Sí, pero... pero desde la semana pasada está. Va, lo felicito entonces. Pero... Ok, guys, let's move to what we're going to do today, right? And this way, okay, right here, option A. We are going to share the screen. Let's start right here and let's move to, to what we have here. Okay, guys. Okay, okay, guys. Well, here is okay. Right here. Okay, right there. Okay, yeah. I don't know if this, this uh, website uh, looks familiar to you. Yeah, it is the meter of the section three. Uh, because we were mentioned about something that we had some problem with the listening. Uh, in this case, the listening area, we're going to work it with the help of the answer that everybody uh, put or select or... Uh, I don't know how many of you remember the answer of the first exercise. Because I you I can share the, the, the audio, but, but I, don't know, I don't know if you... 
I don't know how many of you can log in to the to the website and look for the look for the page. Just we're going to play the audio. That's that's gonna be everything. Okay, I'm going to put it. Oh. I don't know what still having this problem. Okay, let's en la flechita que está el teacher arriba en la parte derecha, tiene que darle para que lo va, le va a abrir otra ventana para poderle escuchar. No, es que lo, ya le permito. No, es que ya me lo abrió aquí, pero el, el problema es este que no sé si, si si ustedes lo van a escuchar. Eso es lo que estamos, es lo que estamos, o sea, buscando la forma. Vamos a ver ahora. Hoy tampoco. No. No, piche. No, no, no se escucha. No se escucha, va, es que me imagino que Eso sí, mismo. Y si, y si alguien lo pone y Tal vez lo escuchan todos. O también puede ser una buena opción, o lo pueden abrir en el teléfono y compartirlo aquí con. con... Ajá. Uh -huh. No sé si te parece si lo hago. Sí, sí, sí. Ahorita. Check the correct answers. Uh -huh. Thank you. Good morning, Michael. Hi, Lucy. How's it going? Pretty good, thanks. How about you? Great. Hey, who's your friend? This is Sylvie Marceau. She's from Canada. Hi, Sylvie. Nice to meet you. I'm Michael Morse. Hi, Michael. It's good to meet you, too. I'm sorry, Sylvie, but what's your last name again? Oh, it's Marceau. How do you spell that? M-A-R-C-E-A-U. I see. So you're from Canada. Are you from Toronto? No, I'm from Montreal. Where are you from, Michael? I'm from Chicago. You know, Sylvie and I are in the same chemistry class this semester. Oh, really? Yeah. And what do you do, Michael? Are you a student here too? Yes, I am. Lucy and I are in the same math class. Oh, is your class interesting? Yes, it is. It's very interesting. And the teacher is really good. By the way, he's from Canada too. <laughs> really? Listen. I'm on my way to the cafeteria now. Are you free? Sure. Let's go and get some coffee. Okay, Sylvie? Sounds great. Okay, gracias. Thank you. Thank you. Who Floricia, right? Was the one to play the audio. Thank you, Floricia. You thank you for helping me. And just keep it, keep the, the page open because we have another one with the one that you can help me. Okay, guys, let's move to the answer number four. Number five. Uh, who Sylvie is? Who is Sylvie? Lucy's friend. Lucy's? Lucy's friend. Okay, thank you, guys. Uh, what about Sylvie? Last name is? Number two. Matsu. 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 Uh huh. Matsu. 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 Okay, Matsu. I think the the uh, oh it might be like a French uh, French uh, last name something like that. Yeah, Lucy, my teacher is really good. Good. Really, good. really good, really good, like me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> okay, thanks, thanks, thanks. Good, good. Thanks, my audience. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we have the number four. They are all where they where they are. In the same school. In the same school. In the same school, right? Okay, guys. Uh, I've been observing that you really were paying attention to to the details on the on the on the audio. Oh, that's that's really that's really nice. Okay. Hola. Yo un audio sí lo tuve que descargar y lo, no le entendía, para ser sincero. Creo que es este de Ben y Ben, de Ben. Ok, lo no. Tuve que, lo tuve que escuchar en, en, 
No, velocidad reducida, porque la verdad no le entendí. <risa> no, no se preocupe. Floricia, ¿nos podría ayudar otra vez con el, 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 el audio? Okay, este, okay. El, 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 de esta parte donde, habla, donde hablamos de Ben. Ok, ahorita. Ann and Ben are talking in a clothing store. Listen and check the correct answers. Hey, those shirts look nice. What do you think, Ben? Yeah, Ann, they do look nice. I really like the blue ones, and the green ones are nice too. Which ones do you prefer? I think I like the green ones better. They're very stylish. Oh, but look at the price. $41. That's expensive. The blue ones are only $29. That's more reasonable. But they're polyester. The green ones are made of better material. They're cotton. Say, Ben, what size are you? Small or medium? I wear a medium. But there aren't any medium ones in blue. They're all large or small. Uh -huh. Wilfredo, ese fue el que le, como que tuvo problemitas para escucharlo usted, ¿verdad? No, no, creo que fue otro teacher, la verdad. Este, ah, ok, no, 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 preocupemos, no nos preocupemos uh -huh. por eso, Wilfred. Este, de, siempre que haya manera de, de ayudarlos, no nos preocupemos, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Para eso estamos. Okay, Va, chicos. Yeah. Ok, let's move. Ben prefer the... Which shirt Ben prefers? Green. Number one. Green, green shirt. shirt. Green, green, green shirt. shirt. Ok, green thank you. Shirt. Green shirt, okay, because he mentioned, right? He was he was <clears throat> making emphasis about the the color that he really like. Okay, let's go to the number two. The blue shirts are twenty nine dollars. Dollars. Twenty. Twenty nine. Twenty nine. $29, okay. Okay. The green shirts are made of? Cotton. Or... Cotton. Cotton, cotton. right. Made cotton. of cotton. 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 Made of cotton. Ben size. Do you already know what is the size, right? The, the, medium. The, medium. 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 Large. And all of that. Okay, the option A. Okay, let's gonna check for the. Let's gonna check the the answer. Okay, let's check the answer, guys. Yeah, you were really you were really great, guys, because uh, in Silvi was Lucy friend. Silvi last name Marsu Marsu. Lucy, my teacher, is really good, yeah. You see, they they are all in the same school. That was no, correct. That was correct. Okay, Ben prefer the green church. Okay. You really were paying attention to the, to the audio. The blue church are... $29, $29. Remember the prices that we were talking about the, the, the last classes, right? $29. Uh, the green shirts are made of coro. Right, right, right. What is the band size? Band size is medium. Medium. I think Ben is like a like a tiny guy because he wears medium size. <laughs> okay, let's move to the B part. This is a little bit more complicated, guys. I don't know if someone can help me. Okay, let's let's read the structure. Fill in the black with the color for or B. Rellena los espacios en blanco con la forma correcta del verbo ser o estar. That is the famous Bear to be, ser or star, right? Okay, let's see the number one. Where oh. we have the we have the empty space. Uh, where, where are where are where are you from, Teresa? Okay. Where are you from? 
Mm -hmm. I am from Mexico City. How about you? Okay, let's let's remember that. R, R, R in the number one. Okay, let's move to this one. Davis, your class. Davis. Is Davis. Is Davis in your class? Is Davis in your class? Yes. We're going to use? Is Davis. Is. Is. Is David. Is David. Okay. Is okay. David. Okay. Let's see what your math class like. It's really interesting. And the teacher's great. What, what, is, is, what, what is, is? What is? What is? What is? What is? What is? What is? Okay. What is? Okay. Let's see the number four. Maria and Brian from Canada, not from England. Are Maria. Are Maria. Are Maria and Brian. Are Maria and Brian. Right. Ah, Maria. Are Maria and Brian. Are Are Maria. Are Maria. Are Maria. Okay, let's move to the part two. Instruction. Complete the following conversation with the simple present. Do you remember that we were talking about the simple present, right, guy? The simple form. El famoso presente, simple. Simple. Okay. Here we have the number one example. Where you work and work in a restaurant. I am, I'm a chef. Where, where do you work? Where do you work? Where do you Where do you work? Where do you work? Do you work? Right, right, right. Where do you work? Where do you work? Okay. Work, work, work. And let's move to the number two. I'm going to read it, guys. Like, what he do exactly? He's a pilot. What? 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 Mm, okay. Let's see the number three. Where does she to school? She go to the Oh. Where does she go? Go. Where does? Where does? Where does she go? Go. Goes. Go. No. Go. 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 Where does she go? Ok, vamos a revisar eso entonces ahorita. Vale, chicos. Ok, let's go and see. Here we were talking about, here we were talking about the four of B, right? Uh, guys, please, could you turn off the microphone? Just only open the, uh, at the moment of speaking, right? Uh, do me that favor, please. Uh, here we have the number... One, the right answer was R. Why do you think R is the right answer for the number one exercise? Mm -hmm. Why do you think, guy? R is the right answer because no, not only gonna say ah, this is the right answer, and that's it. No, we need to find out why. R is the right answer for the exercise that we have that we have here. Why do you think we choose R as a, the right answer? Or why R is the right answer? Because the subject is you. Hmm? Because, because it's the right uh, so R for a subject. So with subject you they, uh, we, I am, you are, is, is, is uh -huh. are, and ah. subject, he, she, it, is, is. Yeah, because they go together, right? As I, uh, we were watching in, in the chapter in which they were working, remember that each subject goes with uh, their corresponding for the bird to be, right? This one goes with this one, this one goes with that one, and and that's it, right? Because we're never gonna uh, mix or combine the one that the, the one that don't match. Just only you're gonna select or choose the one that match or are corresponding to each form 
the forum we are talking about or the one that we are using. Okay, let's go to the number two. Let's see right here. David is your class. David, is David in your class this semester. Yes, we're in the same Spanish class. Why we are using here the four is guys? He is because David referred to he is. Okay, because we have a singular form, and this singular form is represented with the name of David. And if we use the another pronoun, we can change David for he, right? For him. But we can also yes. keep, but we can also keep the name. That's no problem. You can keep the name, or you can keep uh, a different a pronoun. Person, teacher. Sorry? Por, por la tercera persona también, vea. Sí, sí, lo que explicaba la compañera. Ajá, o sea, se, se puede hacer lo mismo. Acuérdense de que tenemos el nombre y podemos cambiarlo por cualquier otro pronombre, pero que vaya acorde a la estructura con la cual estamos trabajando. Porque no voy a mezclar estructuras del presente simple con estructuras del pasado participio. O sea, no, no match, ¿verdad? Ajá, entonces por eso se, se lleva el listado. O sea, por eso decía que podemos hacer como ese, ese mix. Y a la larga este, concuerda lo que usted a, a, aporta, don Wilfredo. Ok, let's move to the number to the number three. What your math class like? It's really interesting and the teacher's great. What here we have the same answer. Why we have here the four is. Uh -huh. yeah, because eh, este es, está hablando de la materia que creo que es algo. Oh, oh, oh. Look, look, guys. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're 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 going in we are in the same page. We are on the same page <laughs> with Floricia. Let's see, guys. Uh, what Floricia mentioned was uh, a, lit, a really good detail that, that we can observe or keep in mind at the moment to identify what we are using this pair in this moment. And also, if you are really familiar with the double question, you also gonna remember that. Here Floricia said, ah, teacher, because here we are talking about the math class. And what is that, the math class in this case? It is singular, it is only Yes, yes. One. Oh, ah, okay. ah, okay. Thing. One thing. And that that is telling me, that is like a key word that is telling me to me that the good or the right form that I'm going to use as a proper right answer is going to be, oh, the, the four is. Why? Because just focus on the on the math class and the math class is, is singular because we are not talking math classes. Just we are talking about math class. Yes. Because if this change it, if we change it for classes, that will be very different because we are talking about in plural. But in this case, we are talking about just one specific thing. That's why it keeps in singular. And that, that was a really good observation, Floricia. I really congrats to you because uh, you you have a, an ego life. You have an eagle eyes. <laughs> you are very uh, observing. And okay, let's move to the number four. Maria and Brian from Canada, not from England. Why we use this four? The four R. Because he's talking about uh, plural. He's talking about in the in which way we are talking about plural, Wilfredo. How how, how ah, we can excuse me? <laughs> number uh -huh. four. Number four. No, yeah, 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 yeah. But why we are talking in plural here? Why? Why, Wilfredo? What do you see in this statement? Uh, I'm I'm at the una persona, Maria and Brian. We have more than one person. We have two we have two people we have two people there's not only one person we have two that's why we are referring we are talking in plural in plural 
remember the keyword Wilfredo has, Floricia was telling to us. She focus on one specific word, she focus on the math class, and she said, oh, this is a math class, oh, oh okay, it's, it's singular, that's why it goes with, with, with a singular form. Ah, okay, 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 I'm going to select this one. That's why we focus the right answer is the, uh, the, the four R, why? Because we are Maria and Brian. We have two people. We have two people. It's not singular. Remember the plural uh, start from two and beyond. You cannot say that uh, just one person can make a plural. No. It's from two and beyond. Remember that. Keep in mind. Those little details are the ones that sometimes really help us to understand what we are watching. It's not only necessary that you need that you to handle okay. perfectly the language. Oh, who was speaking? I, uh, Floricia. Yeah, tell I me, Floricia. I have a question. Mm -hmm. um, este, en español, que en inglés me complica. No, no, este, no, 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 no hay problema, Floricia. Ajá. Bueno, en el mm -hmm. caso de dos objetos, se utilizaría, digamos, si, esto, si hablamos oh, de... Oh, ya, ya más o menos le entendí. Sí, mm -hmm. usted dice que no, cosas, sola, ajá, pero... no solamente... Sí. No solamente tomando en cuenta personas, sino que dos objetos, ¿va? Yes. Ah, va, en ese caso, Floricia, no este, aplica la misma regla, son plurales, ya sea... Este, personas, objetos, este, lugares, eh, números, este, recordemos que del, del dos para arriba ya todos ellos son plurales. Yo le pude haber dicho, este, un suponer, este, the blue car and the red, eh, the blue car and the red, and the red car are very good cars. We are talking about two different objects. We are talking about two cars. One is from one color, one is from other color. But we have two different objects. No solamente podemos hablar de personas, Florisa. Podemos hablar de todo eso lo que yo le mencioné a usted, ¿verdad? Ok. Uh -huh. Gracias. Eh, buen punto. Este, me, me, gusta, me gusta ese tipo de, de, de preguntas. Eh, ok, let's move to the part two. Uh, instruction. Complete the following conversation with simple present. Simple present, uh, in other words, is the presente. Presente simple. Okay, guys. Here we have the number one. Where you were, you were in a restaurant, I a chef. The right answer is? Do. 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 Why do? Why do, guys? Why do? Because according with the pres uh, simple present, this do goes with you, we, and they. They. Mm -hmm. they. Even if even if at the beginning of the sentence we have a double question, but the subject that, that is follows that is making emphasis to us that the form that we're going to use of the simple present in order to structure the question is the pair. Do. Remember, do is do work as a as a pair and also work as auxiliary. Remember that. Remember that. But that, that goes according with it. oh here we're going to explain that the, the okay. Here we have another example. What he do exactly? He's a pilot for global airlines. The right answer here is that. Why is that? Here we're going to mention something very important. Do is a bear. Look, the, the, the thing that I was mentioned to you. O sea, do es un verbo. Todo verbo tiene sus tiempos. All the bear has different time or different uh, moments, right? Do is the present. Does is simple present, but in the it is used for the third person. Teaching, what is the third person? Wilfredo, can you remember to us uh, who is the third person? The third person. 
she. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, in the simple present, when we mention the third person, the auxiliary is not going to be do because do goes with you, we, and they. We can combine with the third person because this one do belong to those three. And that belongs to only the third person. And I don't know if you noticed something interesting right here. The thing that I was mentioned to you. Here we have the the, the verb does. But in this case, does also work as an or auxiliary. That's why the rule said if we have at the beginning of the sentence has an auxiliary, the following verb after the subject is going to uh, be in the base form. Eh, si no me han entendido, chicos, siempre que tengamos el verbo das uh, en una oración, ya sea con double question, o sea, para elaborar preguntas, después del sujeto, el verbo que le va a seguir aquí va a ir en su forma base. ¿Por qué? Porque la regla dice que si yo tengo eh, mi verbo auxiliar, que en este caso, el que le sigue, si en este caso tengo das, el que le sigue, Va a ir siempre su forma base. De igual manera, si yo hablo en un pasado, porque el pasado de do es did. Si yo tuviese did aquí, de igual forma la regla me dice, como él aquí me estaba funcionando como auxiliar antes del sujeto, después del sujeto, el verbo que le va a preceder va a ser en su forma base o en su forma original. Eh, no sé si me captaron la idea, chicos. No eh, importa hay... que sea para... Singular o plural. No importa si sea para singular o plural, pero hasta el momento en que él, en que él, en que, en que él está aquí al principio, ¿por qué, ¿por qué elegimos das? Porque mencionamos el auxiliar para la tercera persona. ¿Ok? Entonces, y el verbo que le va a preceder va a ir en su forma base. Aquí, si nos fijamos bien, este, Ana Graciela, tenemos du. ¿Por qué tenemos do como auxiliar? Porque el sujeto es you. Y va con, los, va con los plurales. Este do funciona con los plurales. You, we, and they. En, y porque es nuestro auxiliar al comienzo, el verbo que me sigue después del sujeto, mire, base form. En su forma, base. O en su forma original. Something that, that really can help us, Ana Graciela, to, yeah. to, to, hola. Este, sí, lo que le comprendo ahí es que no importa el tiempo, el, el, el verbo el, no cambia. El tiempo, Floricia, el tiempo nos lo da el, ah, primer, yeah, el, el, pri, el primero, el tiempo nos lo da el primero. Ah, mm -hmm. yo digo, ah, do. Ah, entonces, ah, ah, simple present, ah, ok, das, oh, simple present, ah, ok, eh, go, ah, simple present, ok, but in this case, okay. just we're making emphasis with the auxiliary, do, in this case, the one that we're using, because we also have the, the, the auxiliary have, but we are not going to talk about, uh, uh, about have, because we're going to take more time uh, with, with that. that, that we can take in, I think in the in the other section appears the, the, the uses of the structure have. Okay, don't worry for that, but we're going to keep working and still explaining about the, the, the section and the uses of the rule, right? Okay, Felicia, let's go to the number three. Where does she go to school? She goes to University of Colorado. If you see what we are looking right here, Das. Auxiliary verb. Das has an auxiliary verb. And here we have the so. The subject. The subject. That's why the verb that we're going to use is going to be in the base. Base form. In the base form. I don't know if some of you have get the uh, or comprehend the, the, the uses of. Oh, uh, of this auxiliary in the simple presence. No sé si les ha quedado un poquito claro, chicos. Así no les va a quedar clara la perfección porque sí es bastante eh, extenso porque tendrían que saber más vocabulario con respecto a los verbos, pero de a poco vamos a ir comprendiendo un poco más. No se preocupen por ahí. Ok. 
Let's move to the following part. Circle the world, circle the world, circle the world. Okay, here we have uh, some exercise using possessive adjective. Possessive adjective, guys. Here we have one exercise. Nice to meet you, Rich. And what last name again? What do you think it is the right possessive adjective for this exercise? Your. 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 Your, okay. Your, let's keep it in your. Let's keep it in your. Okay, guys. What about the exercise two option B? My, 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 last, my name. last name. My last name. My last name. My last name. Okay, my last name. What about the number three? This is my new friend, Elizabeth. Everyone calls. Calls her. Beth. Call her Beth. Ah, remember the, the, the section number one. Everyone call me Beth or call me Beth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's why. If you see, ah, very, very interesting. The, the, the uses of the, of the name of Beth right here in the exercise. And let's go to the number four. Uh, hi, Beth. Where the Johnson? First name are Frank and Judy. Mm -hmm. or, or, or. Our first name. Okay, guys. What about this one? Using object pronoun. Mm -hmm. John Deep is our favorite actor. I like. I like him. I, I like, like him. it a lot. I like it a lot. Okay, we're going to keep it. In that way, music videos Damn. aren't very interesting. Do you like them? Them. 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 them? them. Okay. My favorite TV program is Survivor. Oh, do you remember that 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 TV series? Right? I'm a survivor. I know that was the song. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What it, do you think of it, what will be the it? Okay, the moment of the truth. Ta 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 ta. Ta -na -na -na. Okay, let's go to check the possible answer. Ooh, he was here first. <laughs> okay, he was here first, and then we move to the outside part. Okay, guys. Here we have the exercise number one. According to possessive adjective. O oh, en buen español, el adjetivo pose sí. ¿Qué quiere, ¿Qué quiere decir eso? Que nos está diciendo sentido de pertenencia de algo. Por eso se llaman adjetivos posesivos, porque nos dan eh, la, la idea o la opción de pertenencia de algo. Ok, here is it. Nice to meet you. Rich, and what's your last name? Why we use... Therefore, your because we are making emphasize about her name. Her about love. about that person about about the about his or her or her last name. That's why we focus directly on the person, right? We are talking about your two 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 two. Okay, let's move right here. Let's move right here. Last night is Parker. It's nice to meet you too. Why do you think is my is the the right answer? Why, guys? Me, no. Me, me, me. Mm -hmm. Armando is speaking, right? Yes. Okay. Why? Because is. My. Yeah. My. Because first person. Mm -hmm. First person. My. Me, 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 me. In this case, it will be in Spanish, me. My last name is Parker. It's nice to meet you, too. Okay, guys. Let's move to the third one. This is my new friend, Elizabeth. Uh, my new friend, Elizabeth. Everyone calls... Her, 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 
her bed. bed. Todos la llaman a ella bed. Estamos haciendo eh, indicación o referencia hacia ella, hacia bed, hacia bed. Ok, let's continue. Hi, bed, where's the Johnson? First name are Frank and Judy. Why we use or in this case? Because we are making emphasis of two people, but in this case, that something below to the two of them is or. Nuestro, nuestros. Primeros nombres son Frank and Judy. Nuestros, nuestro. It's a sense of belong. Yeah. It's a sense of pertinence. Something like that will, will be the case. Okay, let's move to the object pronoun. The object pronoun is from the one that action the or receive the action sometime. Johnny Depp is my favorite actor. I like him. Him a lot. I like him a lot. I like him. Him a lot. Object because if from the one we are focused the, the attention, right? Music videos aren't very interesting. Do you like them? Then, do you like them? Okay. And to who is making emphasis the pronoun then is making emphasis to the music videos. Videos. Okay, guys. Let's move to the number three. My favorite TV program is Survivor. What do you think of? It because it is making emphasis as an object of TV program. TV program. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. That's that. That means that you you are really paying attention and focus on the exercise. Let's move to the to the other one. Complete the sentence. Yeah, let's go. Going to complete the sentence. Fill in the gap with the corresponding time expression. Time expression, guys. Time expression. Really, do you remember that, right? Time expression. Expresiones con tiempo. With tic-tac-toe. Tic-tac-toe. <laughs> okay. Let's continue, guys. The exercise number one. I slept. At. At. At 10 p.m. on weekends. Okay. John gets home late at, at night. At night. Okay, guys. Okay. They have lunch on, on Saturday. 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 On Saturday. I go to bed around 11 in the evening. In the in evening. The in the evening. Okay. In the evening. Okay. In the evening. We have class. In the, morning. in the morning. In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Okay. Let's move to the part two. Demonstrative pronoun. Or the famous pronoun de demonstrativos. The one that I show to demonstrate something to someone else. Or to refer to something else, right? How much is this? This. this is it this. how much this. Uh, how much is this this, this. 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 wash this uh, wash how much is it how much is it we were talking about how much? The, this section during the week remember remember oh. guy how much is it how much, uh, okay, is this this, this, exactly. Yeah. This. Okay. This. 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 Yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she is. Okay. Let's move to the number two. Look at. Those. 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 This. 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 Okay. 
Excuse me, I like that. I like that. 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 Can I see it, please? What about the number five? She likes those. 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 Okay, guys. That means that you were really paying attention. I really feel glad about to hear that. Okay, let's going to check the answer. The moment of truth. Ta 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 ta. Pa -na -na -na. Pa -na -na -na. Okay, guys. Let's move right here. I sleep. You see? Until or mm. at. Why we use at? Because we remember this at to mention one specific hour, oh. one one oh, specific wow. time. Remember mm. that all the time. Remember that. Mm. John gets home late. At. Why we use at? Because remember the chief. The chief meme. Eh, el turno del cual nosotros estemos hablando, si es mañana, tarde o noche. noche. Mm, that's what, that, that's what uh, Chief refers to the, the to the time what we're referring to. In this, in, this, in this case, we're referring to the night Chief. Teacher, y el app solo lo utilizamos entonces en la noche, at night. No, o sea, at, pues, at the morning. Mm, en este caso es in the morning in the morning en, en el caso de die solamente sería at pero les hacía énfasis con los con los turnos pero o sea como los turnos estarían mañana tarde y noche verdad en el español pero en este caso como lo que lo que usted dice at night porque si estamos hablando ya en la mañana si ya estamos hablando más temprano mire es In. 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 in, in, es in. What about this one? Uh, they have lunch on. on Saturday. Why we use on? Because we are referring to to a, to a day. Keep in mind that to a specific day. If we are going to refer to a specific day, we are going to use on, the preposition on, 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 on. Okay. Uh, here they say we're talking about invert. I go to bed around 11 in the evening. The chief is in the evening. Just at night. Just at night, it's going to be used as at. And We have classes in the morning, in the morning, in, in, the, morning. in the morning. You're never going to use at the morning. You're always going to use it at, at night. In is in the morning, in the evening. Just keep in mind that, the morning and evening. That's it. Oh, in the, in the afternoon too, in the afternoon too. In the afternoon. In, mo morning. Uh, afternoon and evening. Those only gonna be the only three. The only section gonna be night. It's gonna at. Be, at. at. Teacher. Okay. Y al mediodía. At noon. At noon. Mm -hmm. Es la otra sección que hay. A mediodía, at noon. Why we use the preposition at? Because it's, it's making emphasis about uh, the half of the day. O sea, eso va uh, directamente mm. al, al énfasis de, de, de la mitad del día at noon. at noon hay unos casos bien raros que yo los he escuchado pero no es gramáticamente correcto ni bien decirlo eh, eh, yo lo he escuchado en unas traducciones también que dicen at noon pero para referirse en la noche uh, tam mm -hmm. también eh, eh, son, son casos son casos bien bien eh, bien bien raros at noon at noon at midnight entonces son casos bien 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 aislados verdad eh, son bien poco poco usados okay let's continue with the set part two fill the center with demonstrative pronoun remember the demonstrative pronoun right guys 
Okay, how much is this? This. 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 Watch. I can find a price. I can find a tag price. Okay. Look at those. Those, those. those. those purple jeans over there. Aren't they stylish? Stylish. Number three. I like this. Yes, these gold earrings. They look great on me. Excuse me, I like that. Uh, cap. Cap. Can I see it, please? Yeah, you can see it. <laughs> she likes those glasses. Those glasses over there. Guy, did you remember mm -hmm. that the, that we were talking about uh, this structure, right? About this and that. You can you can uh, answer or help me in Spanish if you want it. How we use this and that? Eso. Cuando están cerca. Cuando están cerca y son plurales. Plural, singular. Mire. Singular, singular. 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 Dos, dos, y y singular. Ajá, plural, singular. Plural, perdón. Dicen dos. En dos. Plural. Away. Plural. Plural, far away. Plural, far away. Okay. What about that? Singular. Singular, singular. singular and near. Lejos. Oh, singular, near. but near. Far, far away. No, no, no. No? Far, ah, away, far, 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 far away. That, far away. that is far away. This, uh, this, this, this near. is near. 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 In singular. Near. That is far away. In singular. Singular. Mm -hmm. Those is in plural, but far away. 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 Huh? Far away. Far away. Those plural. Far, far, far away. Far away. Plural. Far away. And this plural. 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 Near. 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 Near, 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 near. Remember that guy. It's not, it's not complicated. It is easy. This kind of structure. It's not a big deal. But. Cuesta I, eso. No, no, no costaría mucho. Le, lo sentimos que cuesta es, es debido a raíz de tal vez como de, de la, la, la misma falta de. de practice. De, practice. De práctica, ajá. De, the lack of practice. That, that might be the case. But during the way you practice and you're going to keep in mind, remember that those kind of things. The bad thing in those exercises that when you write it, you must be very directly at the moment what you want to refer when you are writing because it, it might be tricky using this, those, that in, in a sentence. Because it's easier at the moment to, to speak because you make emphasis. Oh, that one, this one, this, those. It's, it's more complicated in, in the in, in a sentence, in the written way. Okay, let's move to the last part. We almost finished, guys. Don't worry for that. Here we have an article. Read the email, then check the correct answer. Lee el correo, después marque las respuestas correctas. Here we have an email. We have an email. Hi, Ernesto. In your email message, you ask me, what do I do every day? Well, I'm a student at the University of Michigan. I really like my class. I study computer science and Chinese. Mm, computer science and Chinese. I go to school around 8 in the morning on weekdays around noon. I have lunch with some classmates on Mondays and Fridays. I work out in the gym before my classes and in the late afternoon. On Tuesdays and Thursdays, 
My friend Daniel and I have part-time jobs. We work in the school cafeteria and I study in the library every weeknight until about 2 a.m. I'm a full-time student and I don't have time to watch TV. Oh, that's a very sad life of this guy. He doesn't have time for watching TV. It's a very sad story. And what do you do? Send me another email, please. Your new e friend, Chris. Ah, this is making emphasis like this in the old time. Nowadays, everybody use WhatsApp, use Line, use uh, Zoom, use, uh, I, I don't know, know. Telegram. Oh, yeah, there's, there's another different tool. I, I think that nowadays, mm, you guys, you don't use a, an email in order to send a message to your friend just for telling to him or her, hey, how are you? How do you feel? I hadn't heard about you a long time ago. No, use just typing a, a message and you send to the number that you already have. That's it. That, that is what technology, um, that's why technology makes our life easier. Yeah. Okay, guys, uh, you were really paying attention to the, oops, sorry. You were really paying attention to the email, right? Let's go in to check the possible answer that we have right here. Ernesto is Chris, Chris what? New friend. New friend. New? New friend. friend. New, new friend. friend. New friend. Okay, new friend. It's a new. Chris is a full-time student. Mm -hmm. Because he is mentioning right here. I am a full-time student. Student. A student. Okay, guys. Daniel. Daniel, what? What is Chris friends. Chris is friends. Chris friends. Chris friends. Friend. Okay, thank you, guys. What about on Tuesday and Thursday, Chris? Work with work with with Daniel. Here we have Daniel. Thursday. On Tuesday and Thursday, my friend Daniel and I have part-time. Part-time job. Okay, guys. Now let's gonna check the possible answer that we might be here on our screen. Oh, you were very good. You were really good, right? This really make me feel yeah, nice. <laughs> Um okay, new friend, the post the, the right answer. Full time student is Chris friend works with Daniel. Daniel. Works with Daniel. Okay, guys, what we have done today. Just we we make a not a little uh, we we can we can say uh, a long feedback about the the meter of the section three and I consider that you really Teacher. focus. Hola. Teacher, disculpa que lo interrumpe, pero fíjate que se me va a acabar la se me está botando la batería y por si pasa el lista tal vez ya voy a tener apagado el teléfono. Va, Karina. Karina Beatriz. Recordemos chicos, Karina Beatriz también, ¿verdad? Ok. Uh, well guys. Oh, gracias, teacher. Gracias. Okay. You're welcome. Okay, guys. This really made me feel uh, well great because that means that all the effort that I put to to teach you a little bit what I know it's is resulting in something good, right? Uh, why we why is resulting in something good? Because here we are showing the what we are learning in in those topics, right, or in those sections, and also refer that you are focused in all the classes, and also you work in the platform, and well, I, 
I tell you that is a great effort that you are doing and I congrats to all of you because uh, I really appreciate what you are doing, this great effort that you put all the night from from Monday to Thursday to being here in paying attention for one hour, being sitting at home and watching the screen. And I really appreciate your effort, guys. And this effort will uh, give you something great in the in the future. Okay, guys, let's going to call. We're gonna call the roll, right? Let's going to call the roll. Oops, we I have it right here. I think I lost. Oh, I have it right here. Don't worry, guys. Okay, let's gonna call the roll. For today class. Uh, Ana Graciela Ramos Garcia, are you there? Yes, I'm teacher. Okay, thank you. Anderson Jeremy Molina Celaya. Anderson. Anderson. No está Anderson, no lo escucho. Eh, Armando Antonio Albanes. Here, teacher. Thank you, Antonio. Blanca Stephanie. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Karina Beatriz. Yeah, she was with the running out of battery, right? Uh -huh. Bye. Carlos Aníbal. I'm here. Okay. Daniel Alejandra. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Diana Patricia. Present, teacher. Okay. Present. Eh, Elsa Noelia. Present. Okay. Eh, Floricia Mengíbar. Floricia Mengiba. Present. Okay, thank you. Henry Alexander. Henry, you were there? I can hear Henry. Okay, Ingrid Esmeralda, I think I saw you. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Jaime Iván. Here, teacher. Okay, thank you, Jaime. Uh, Jocelyn Alicia. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Uh, Karina Yamilet. Present, teacher. Okay. Uh, Carla Gabriela Garcia. Present, teacher. Okay. Thank you. Maria Imelda. Present, teacher. Okay. Maria Wendy. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Wendy. Marisol de Los Angeles. Present teacher. Thank you. Miguel Ángel Clemente. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Nelson Rutilio. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Uh, Romel José. Romel José Marín. No, he's not there. Ronald Alexander. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Uh, Rosa Elizabeth. Rosa. Un millón de Rosa. It's not there. Bruno de mí. Present. Okay, and Wilfredo, you were there. I hear. Okay, thank you. Uh, Okay, guys, uh, chicos, este, bueno, digo esto en español para que eh, lo puedan este, comprender la mayoría, ya que algunos me comentaban que a veces las explicaciones se les hacen eh, difícil entenderlas o comprenderlas al 100% en, en inglés, ¿verdad? Eh, sé que es difícil, pero de a poco lo vamos a ir rescatando cada vez más y más y más. Eh, aprecio, felicito, aplaudo todo el esfuerzo que ustedes están haciendo la verdad, porque no es fácil estar una hora prácticamente sentado y más pegado a una pantalla, verdad imagino que la mayoría de ustedes también trabajan con, 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 con screens con, con sus computadoras en, en sus trabajos y no es fácil este, es un gran esfuerzo verdad lo poquito, que, lo poquito que se aprende siempre el día de mañana sirve, sí, verdad, decíame el, los consejos sabios de mi, de, de mi difunto padre 
de que todo lo que uno aprende en esta vida sirve, independientemente sea su área o no sea su área, yo los motivo que siempre este, se motiven a algo que realmente les llame la atención, porque para poder aprender inglés, para poder aprender un idioma, lo primero que tiene que haber es que o le llame la atención o le guste, cualquiera de las dos, 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 dos formas, ya es lo primero para entrar, ya es lo primero para entrar, y de ahí usted se va solito, ahí va con el, en el mismo camino, va aprendiendo, aprendiendo, aprendiendo y aprendiendo, entonces este, agradezco enormemente ese esfuerzo que hacen, ¿verdad? Y ya verán que tarde o temprano siempre sus resultados positivos los va a tener, ¿verdad? Eh, bueno, esto sería todo por, por ahora, ¿verdad chicos? Eh, pasen buenas noches, eh, esperamos vernos si Dios nos regala vida hasta el próximo lunes, ¿verdad? At, until the next week, until the next week, on Monday. The same platform, the same canal, the same time, the same, the same what? What else? El mismo que? Ok, chicos. Eh, ok, eh, gracias, ¿verdad? Eh, pasen feliz noche, chicos.